Are we drinking cocktails? Yeah. Are we? Oh, yeah. oh, I've been waiting Just for this. Two girls drinking cocktails, I've shooting been. the shit. I mean, fest is like uh, festive holidays, like the holiday season. The winter holidays. Yes. Yes. Right. Gotcha. Sorry. Sorry. Yes. So cranberry. Yes, of course. Peppermint. Cinnamon. Childhood trauma. Yeah, yas, yas. Okay, yeah, I'm feeling festive. I'm so excited. <gasps> and I have, is there a little bit of red in these earrings or are they more brown toned? Well, I mean, it's like a tor- uh, Yes, a yes! I'm gonna assume. What do we got here? I'm uh, excited. It's, it's, a, it's a holiday. Oh, it's a holiday. Oh, it's, 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 oh it's, we're doing the video now. Yeah. Sorry. Yeah. Oh, I see, okay. Oh, there's clothes in this one. Ooh. Okay, okay. How exciting. I'm curious. I am the beholder. Oh my god. Ooh, I love that. Smells gingery. Okay, what's your theory? Hit me. There's, I think there's whiskey in it, but I think there's whiskey in everything. This is a Hanukkah cocktail. Oh! I have the beholder. I hardly know her. I have the beholder. I hardly know her. Uh, sorry. <laughs> You'll make a great dad one day. Thank you so much! <laughs> Merry <laughs> holiday. Ha happy Hanukkah. Yes. Oh my god, it's delicious. That's lovely. It's lovely. That is refreshing. Absolutely. It's very summery. I think there's ginger ginger ale. Ginger beer. Mm-hmm. It's lovely. Is there apple? There's cider, I think, yeah. Oh, yeah. that's what it is. Yeah. It's, a, it's a little bit summery. It's, it's quite, quite summery. Quite, quite refreshing. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. This is dangerous, right? Because it's so smooth. Uh -huh. The alcohol is so inoffensive. You could come home and be like, oh, I want a glass of lemonade and then just gum this Honestly, instead. Yeah, vodka, ginger beer, apple cider, bitters, gold, and lemon. Really? There's vodka? In that? Wow, that, that's a beautiful drink. Yum, that's that really sounds like so pleasant. Like a little potato blini or something. Mm. The cloves are interesting. <laughs> oh, refreshed is like is what I want to be like after the holidays. During the holidays, I want to I want to be I want to be sleepy most of the time. Yes. I mean, vodka isn't really a very strong flavor in mm. any drink that it's ever in. That's kind of the point of vodka. If you whacked like one of those thick milkshake straws into this, I would just be like. Gone. Um, it's a good thing there's ice. So the iron beholder pays homage to classic potato latkes, a traditional Hanukkah dish served with cream and apple sauce. There you go. Wow, okay, yum. I guess beauty really is in the eye of the beholder. No, it isn't. Ruin yeah. the holidays. Yeah. <laughs> this is what the holidays are for. We're going to fight about this, okay? I'm trying to finish one. Yeah, she's trying to finish hers. Why is it called the Eye of the Beholder? Is it because it's not a particularly beautiful drink? Is it because if you drink enough of these, you'll think everybody is beautiful? <laughs> Serena, are you ready for our Hanukkah? Yeah. <laughs> it's too refreshing, so we'll give it a 9 out of 10. I mean, I thought it was... Do you want to give it a 10 out of 10? We're just going to go full on Golo on this? I mean, come on, it's the holidays. It's the holidays. 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10. Happy Hanukkah, everyone. This is for St. Patrick's Day. Obviously, yes, yes. Go holiday cocktail, St. Patrick's, St. Patrick's Day. This is fun. Wow! It looks like my daddy, the Grinch. This is for Kwanzaa. Ah, oh, Kwanzaa! And it's called the Stinger. The Stinger. Oh boy. A Stinger! Oh my god, okay. I'm just like. Do we think that it's gonna be spicy? I think it's gonna be like. Sour? Oh, wowzers. Wowzers. It's like petrol. Look at the fumes. Super mutant juice. It's like Shrek's piss. <laughs> That's all I ever wanted. Kwanzaa. Oh my god, the taste of that, not even in my mouth yet. Like, you, you can taste it before you drink it. <laughs> ah, very medicinal. That's, that's that is Listerine. <clears throat> it's brilliant! If you make that sound, <laughs> I'm nervous. It's so minty! Oh boy, it should be in this bigger glass. The idea is the brandy will warm you up, and the minty flavour is reminiscent of crisp, fresh smell. I kind of get it. I would only get it because of that cool, you know, like cool mint. Wow! Okay, this is special. This is like pepperminty. Yeah, I wasn't expecting a velvety taste. Oh, yeah. Because I'm never left behind the velvet rope. So what yes. I will do is, how dare you, sir, and lick the yes. rope. And yes. that's what it kind of tastes like. Yes. And then, but then I'm like, how dare you, Ooh. It's really strong tasting, and there's definitely a bit of a kick to the creme de menthe, but you don't really taste the brandy. Invented in the early 1900s by African-American Tom Bullock, it's a great way to pay tribute to the unity of, of African-American culture in the States. Now look, and we got the green and red. It's like a bouse of holly. Oh! oh which is a Christmas, Christmas thing, thing. this is a Kwanzaa, Kwanzaa, so Kwanzaa just... Thing. Sorry, sorry guys. All respect to Kwanzaa, but we have to we have to be the tri-channel triers, and we wouldn't be the tri-channel triers if we weren't being honest. And so we have to come at this critically, and this is garbage. I'll tell you one thing though, 
much more of a holiday feel to it, though. And you can feel it in your cheeks. It's like yeah. a warm it's sensation. It's like here, and it's at the back of the top of my mouth. Yeah. This does remind me of my, my dad's liquor cabinet, like. Yeah, yeah, you just fucking mix things together. You're like, okay, this should get us drunk. The last one was just a very tasty drink that you could knock back and without even thinking. This one has a purpose. You're making it for a purpose. I didn't think these were that dangerous, but I am giggly, and my mm. face feels warm. Mm -hmm. my, my top is askew, <laughs> my hair is down. I'm ready. To be stung, <laughs> I'm about to make some bad decisions. <laughs> this looks delicious. This looks so good. It reminds me of Bailey's. Oh, oh. oh. mama. Wow! Berry or eggy or something. There's definitely like ginger in this. This is called a gingerbread six. Yum. Yeah. It looks lovely. It looks that lovely. looks. That looks. Wintry. I don't know, should a cocktail ever have a crust? <laughs> Probably a gingerbread cookie, I'd imagine, something like that. Ooh, Would it be? Maybe. What are you thinking? Can we get a fire going? That's a nice little snowy drink. Yeah, it oh, is. It's a lovely little oh. snowy drink. This smells lovely. I'm gonna guess there's some Baileys in there. Are you into building gingerbread houses? I, 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 I did it <laughs> once before, and these marks are from doing it. I won't go back there. I can't watch that video. Oh, it's lovely. It's wonderful. I was mid-sip and I could feel my cheek going red from me blushing as I made eye contact <laughs> with the camera. Definitely babies with a little bit of ginger sprinkling. Good night and good luck. Good night and good luck, boys. Let's just go with it. Oh, boys. Oh, boys. It's actually really nice. The gingerbread works, or whatever <laughs> that is, works with the Baileys. That's Baileys, gingerbread syrup, vodka, and crumbled gingerbread turnip. Vodka. I'd love this. That's it. Oh. It's Baileys and vodka. Do you get vodka from this? Uh, not until you said it, but I suppose it tastes a bit stronger than a regular Baileys. And the great thing is, I'm sure at the end of it, you got some soggy biscuit that you can enjoy. I'd prefer just a plain old Baileys, I'm sorry. I don't get any of the ginger syrup. Like, Baileys is not a drink that you're like, oh, I'm going out, let me get a bottle of Baileys, and that's <laughs> like... Have a screen. Baileys is very much a Christmas drink. Absolutely. Yeah, you have to have some Baileys on, on Christmas. I think it's very Christmassy. I like it. <laughs> but I'm broke. <laughs> I think it's very Christmassy and I like it. Happy out. This is great. I'm very blah. I'm making this a Christmas. Are you making this a Christmas? This is great. This is yum. It's mm. easy to drink. I'm. I, I, I know that I'm getting plastered when I have like that little bit of red in the cheeks. And the gingerbread, like this is what I'm saying. You got the nice little biscuit at the end. You probably get a like, little sweet kick when, you're, when, it's, all, when it's all melted down. Mm -hmm. All the alcohol, alcohol is gone. I think that the vodka gives it an extra little bit of a je ne sais quoi, but I don't. <laughs> it's so stuff very in. Italian, it's like. <laughs> Weather outside is frightful. The fire is so delightful. And sis, I'm going to go high, you go low. Sis, there's no place to go. Let it snow, let it snow, let it snow. No, no, you'll shut up and take my money. I don't know what's in this pool, but like, I want to swim in it. Egg in celebration of the winter solstice. Yes. Is you. New Grinch, baby. I really like martinis. I'm a huge fan. You'll of be happy when you're <laughs> drinking this martini. <laughs> Colin, you, I feel like that's like a that's like a bit of a you energy doing a pun. I'm really oh, bad at this. This seems more like an aisle martini, and that's more of a Yule martini. Huh? Huh? Yeah. I really like that. It's a really weird. <laughs> Oh, okay. Flavor, flavor profile, but it's really nice. Oh, a bit of a hoo at the end there, isn't it? <coughs> wow. Okay, bitch, like sneaking up on me like that. I'm not surprised some pagans came up with this, to be honest. There's, uh, there's a little bit of bitterness in it. Yeah. I think I think pagans are a little bitter that all the other religions kind of got big. My cinnamon stick has a little break in the I'm middle. I'm so sorry. I have to work twice <laughs> not hard. sorry at all. All right, the martini was coming from inside the house. That is exactly <laughs> what it is. <laughs> Following Bailey's is a bit, is a bit of a tough, so, you know what I mean? It, like, it kind of felt like the last one was Christmas. And this is like January 1st. Oh, boys. What a gorgeous drink. Yeah, this is beautiful. Also, these <clears> glasses, <throat> um, I know, they they just make you feel like reckless. Winter yeah. solstice, also known as Yule. Be no, old. Yule. Oh. <laughs> 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 that's not a biscuit, the other one, a creme de menthe. This We've is got just, a cinnamon stick. I know, but. It looks like a Yule log. 
Yes. Is she also that something? Yes. Something about this that you're just like, ooh, is she gonna spill? Is she not? It's just so fun. It feels a little dangerous. It does feel dangerous. I think you're a woman who likes a little danger, to be honest. I'm sensing this vibe. <laughs> it's not comparable to a normal martini because this is a martini in the same way that an apple teeny or an espresso martini is a martini, as in not at all. It's, it needs to, needs to slap you in the dick straight off, otherwise you're just gonna focus on your Kwanzaa and your Hanukkah and your Christmas treats. Yeah. Do you know what exactly. I mean? What is Santa Claus? What? Who is his father? I do like when a big man comes down my chimney. <laughs> I like experiencing other cultures, especially through alcohol. Yes, yes, yes. Well, we, we were here for a cultural experience and we got it. I'm feeling happy. I'm feeling weirdly energetic. I'm into it. Bring on the festivities. Absolutely. I felt like we want, went on like a little cultural tour. Uh, I think uh, I think we could be drunker, but we're nicely buzzed. You know what I think we are? I think we're merry. Aww. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> like, like and subscribe, subscribe ring, ring the bell, bell press, press all, all for, for notifications. notifications. We it put out videos, videos every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday for your entertainment. Ta-da, Mercedes!